Korea's 10 public enterprises with the highest liabilities will have to pay a staggering 60 trillion won or 56 billion U.S. dollars in interest payments alone over the next five years. Ruling Senate Party lawmaker Lee Jae-young made the forecast Wednesday after analyzing finance ministry data, which shows the combined debt of the 10 state-owned firms will rise from $254 billion this year to $279 billion in 20. 2017. Although it's impossible to forecast the future rates, E based his projection on the current average interest rate of 4.3 percent. Korea Land and Housing Corporation topped the list, accounting for 40 percent of the total debt with $104 billion this year, followed by Korea Electric Power Corporation and Korea Gas Corporation.